Good morning! The, this is a childhood scrapbook. I was moving some stuff around and found this scrapbook, so I thought I would do a quick flip through before I moved it to its new uh, storage space in my hope chest. So this is like from the 90s. Um, like, I don't know. I'm just gonna flip through it. Self-explanatory. It's This is what I was taught, I've mentioned before in my junk journaling. Like, look at how big this scrapbook is. That's why I love the current traveler size that I do now. So, let's see, here's a Six Flags souvenir map. So this would have been like grade school and high school. I don't know what this is. Gold foil from something. Um, what is this? I think this was a play. Yeah, this was a play at high school. In 1993, some high school basketball tournament I went to. So when we were kids, we did go to Disney twice. And as you can see, this was 1990, and we stayed at the Disney Inn. So of course, you know, I would kept, I keep all paper scraps, even 20 years ago, 30 years ago, however long that is. Stationery from the Disney Inn. Let's see. Um, more stationery from the Disney Inn. Little gift bag from Walt Disney World. The Disney Inn is no longer there. Um, I think it used to be, then it turned into like something green and now, I, for, I know what it was now, but I forgot. Someone was telling me it's a completely different hotel, but sorry, I don't remember. If anyone knows what the Disney Inn is now, please comment down below and this is a bag from MGM Studios which is now Hollywood Studios and look even back then I kept all like tags when I bought something and I remember like how nowadays I keep receipts I did it back then I didn't even realize baked goods whatever this was was 50 cents probably a cookie don't know what it was so and then we stayed at the days Inn. so this is just Stuff from the days in, and we went shopping at Walmart, Kmart. So I kept those tags. We went to Sea World. So stuff from Sea World, and then just more clothing tags I bought. Econo Lodge. So we would have drove from Illinois at the time I was living in Illinois. So we would have driven from Illinois to Florida, and apparently it rained because here's a bag for an adult poncho more yeah I'm, i can't believe i kept these bags aren't these the bags that you're supposed to put your sanitary napkins in oh what i did as a kid and then um here was a high school graduation pamphlet i went to someone graduated ticket stubs ticket the oh my god back then it was only dollar fifty to see a movie some kind of mcdonald's scratch toy some museum I went to about dinosaurs. All right, what else do we got? So these are just cutouts from the newspaper. And you know I love New Kids on the Block, so cutouts from New Kids on the Block. This is me looking happy about something. I won some award, grade point average award. Some more New Kids clippings. Oh my God, I really like New Kids on the Block. Oh, this is me buying gloves. I was a um, flag girl and I had to have gloves. And he's on the block napkin. What else we got going on? More newspaper cutouts. I think this was my dad's high school reunion. The Wienermobile came to town, so that was a big deal. This is gonna be a long video, because, oh my goodness. So now this is high school, I see, see? That's me, I was a flag girl. And then it's the football team and the cheerleaders. Oh my God, how do I turn this around? Here we go. So we went somewhere and stayed at the Marriott, St. Louis. Oh, so we came to St. Louis for summer, you know what? I think we came to St. Louis for a new kids, con new kids maybe. Here we go. Yep, Bush Stadium, new kids on the block, August 26th. 1990 so Melissa was my friend at the time and her mom took us to this concert so yep look at this $23 
August 26, 1990. So cool. So we were living in Illinois at the time, so driving to St. Louis to see this was a really big deal, but uh, Melissa's mom was the best. Super sweet. And more labels, clothing tags, and then this is Jonathan's autograph. Which, I mean, I'm going to be honest, I don't remember that at all, but Melissa's, we definitely hung out at hotels, so it vaguely sounds familiar that we saw them at the hotel they were staying at. So, Melissa's mom was definitely the type that knew all the gossip and knew where they would be and totally stalked them for her daughter so Melissa could meet them and we were along for the ride. So, we got Jonathan's autograph. Pretty darn cool. And then... See, balloons is apparently not a good thing to store. They got sticky and gross. Let's see. Went to the Springfield Theater to see To Kill a Mockingbird. You remember the old school printouts on Dot Matrix printouts? Oh, yeah. And then what else we got? Just some Halloween stuff, just random stuff. I don't know, ordering pictures through the school. Here's another play program. Oh my god. Sometimes I'm ruining these pages. Some stuff I kept stuck. Hold on one second. Oh my god. Oh, I'm ruining it. What's, sorry, that was like the worst. What is it? It's the balloons again. Uh, sorry, that was like the worst view. Note to self, don't tape balloons in your scrapbooks. They do not survive the test of time. All right, so more stuff, I don't know what. More programs, I actually drew this in art class, so that was cool. Apparently we went to Chuck E. Cheese for something because there's a Chuck E. Cheese sticker. And then just more tags I collected. Christmas tags, stickers. Went to the theater to see Honey, I Shrunk the Kids. Um, oh, I remember this story. This was a fellow high school kid who died because he was a passenger in a car, he wasn't wearing a seatbelt, and the driver was driving like an idiot and he died, so very sad. And then stickers, Valentines, you can tell I was young, I crossed out all my ex-boyfriend's faces. <laughs> um, oh, another New Kids on the Block concert. This one was in University of Illinois, November 8th, 1990. Pool pass, that's what I did every summer. I went to the pool and hung out. Uh, TV guide, and for whatever reason, I clipped that out. Dance programs, business cards. So this is all stuff. This So, yeah, this is high school. This is a congratulations note when I made the flag team. More graduation announcements. Let's see. This is not my graduation. I did not graduate at 91. It is just friends. I you know, I probably dated someone who graduated. And then, oh my god. Oh my god. Think of this fad. Okay, this is back then. People had hermit crab necklaces and they wore live hermit crabs around their neck for eight dollars. Oh my god. The Humane Society says it's cruel to do this. But if you send a self-addressed stamped envelope, they'll tell you where you can get one. Oh my god, I didn't know people did that. That is crazy. Let's see, more. Oh, here's another New Kids on the con Concert. That's like, what, my third ticket, April 3rd, 1991. I didn't realize I even went that much when I was a kid. More Valentine's. Oh, it's sticky again, and I see balloons. I don't know if I'm even gonna try. Oh, darn it. Balloons, definitely. And this was prom stuff. Okay. Can I get this? I'm not even going to try. I can tell. Look, there's a corsage in there. This is prom stuff. 
I'm gonna have to gently pry it apart later on. Lesson learned, do not keep balloons. Okay, more tags of stuff I bought. Oh, I won a contest on a Disney Channel. I won a Mickey Mouse Club clock. I still have it somewhere. So that's the letter telling me I won. Um, oh, another pool pass for 91. More clippings from the newspaper. And let's see. I think this was, oh yeah, this was a, another high school girl who died. It was very sad. So that was from her funeral. Football homecoming stuff. More, look at all these ticket stubs. I went to the theater a lot, only a dollar fifty. This one I came to visit dad. This was Christmas break, two seventy-five in St. Louis. Star Star Trek, Star Trek. More Christmas tags. Christmas concerts. Let's see. More programs. Valentine's. Another graduation. Not me. Not for sure. I don't know. I think we just knew everyone every year, so we always went to the high school graduations, even though it wasn't ours. Because we only had like 90 people graduating, so everyone went to the graduation. Let's see. I used to be a tap dancer, so that is from that. And then... More high school stuff. More tickets. Oh, we went to Six Flags. So, over Mid-America, so that'd be Chicago. And we usually do that for field trips. Another something. This was someone's wedding. I don't remember that one. Illinois State Fair parking tickets. Another swim pass. Let's see. I did swim team, so the swim team schedule. Oh, I ran a 5K back then. I'm just not even halfway through. Jeez Louise. These scrapbooks were huge. No wonder it's like my whole high school. More programs. Boys basketball schedule. More movie stubs. I don't, I don't know what all these coupons are for. I'm assuming they're tickets. More Christmas stuff. Oh, another uh, wedding. I remember back then, everyone always had their name printed on their napkins at weddings. And more Christmas stuff. There's a banquet for 4-H. I vaguely remember that. Not really. I guess I was in 4-H. I don't really remember. And then... National Honor Society. I was in National Honor Society. And let's see. More movie tickets. I don't know what that one is. Just end of nowhere. I don't know what that one is. Kool-Aid packet, because why not? I don't know why I have a Kool-Aid packet. Okay. Colorado Rockies. Okay, this is when I went on vacation with my dad. We drove to Colorado, and I guess we went to a baseball game. And saw a Hamlet for whatever reason. I think that was a school outing. Why? I don't have any. Like, the only thing I'm noticing is I don't have any report cards. I don't know where I put all my report cards. Hmm. Oh, what is this? This is me getting really crafty taping all these tags down on a gift bag. Bought something Mickey. And that is it. So apparently I kept the tag of every single clothing item I ever bought. I don't remember that. That's my scrapbook from high school. So I have a couple more if you enjoyed that. I, I will do a video of the other two. See I have those two right there. And these are not scrapbooks. These are just photo albums from when I worked at Yellowstone, you know, before digital cameras were a thing. So, anyway, there you go. My high school scrapbook.